Hello, YouTube family. It's your favorite girl. And I am here to talk about y'all boy CJ So Cool. New video that he just uploaded, Getting My Kids Back. Okay, so CJ starts the video off with his goddamn racing thoughts, saying a bunch of nothing. He don't say this shit a thousand times already. I don't know why CJ got to keep making the goddamn video with the same repetitive, same information. CJ, we don't care how you gonna get your goddamn kids back. When you do get your kids back, show us a video, okay? Stop telling us how you gonna get it. Because at this point, if you don't have them, stop putting your kids in the goddamn title. Trying to use them for some goddamn views, okay? So he's saying everything is going to be handled behind the screens with the lawyers. Okay, so if that's the case, and if it's going to be handled behind the scenes, why is you talking about it right now? Why is you talking about it right now, CJ? Here he go. Talk about I always do right by my goddamn kids. I always try to get my kids. You right. You always try to get the kids so you can put cameras on them. You showed sure in, CJ. You didn't want to go get the kids because you missed them because you want to spend time with them because you want to do a daddy and twins day. You didn't want to go take them out to go get ice cream or take them to the playground or, you know, go do something fun or tell them how much you love them. You want to go get the goddamn camera. You get the camera and put it in the car ready to record for some goddamn views. You right. We don't know you personally. And yes, we can have a side. Yes, the hell we can. Because we can sit here and listen to the shit you say out your mouth. And we can sit here and listen to what Royce say out her mouth. But we not doing that. Well, some of us, the ones with, who got goddamn sense ain't doing that. We paying attention to what the hell we see. Okay? What's up, Royce? Royce Nation, what's up? Apparently, CJ didn't, you know, watch the video that he just put up. He just said that everything is dead. The way that he used to vlog is dead, but he's vlogging the same goddamn way. What? He's talking about he wants y'all to go to the goddamn comments. Because, you know, I'm not wasting my goddamn time going, nobody comments, especially not jokes. Talk about, if you appreciate the way that I'm vlogging, let me know. Hell no! It's all about let me know if you want us if you want me to go back to raw um, footage uncut when you get everything including his address. No, we want you to go back when you was with royalty and the kids. Can you do that? Can you do that? Keep in mind everything that is said in this video is allegedly and it's my opinion. Child CJ think he's slick. He had to pay goddamn D Lo for an appearance. D Lo ain't want to be there. You try to use D Lo to put in your goddamn in your damn vlog because you think that's going to get you some goddamn views because D-Lo in the video? CJ, go sit your big ass down. And then you try to sneak and put Bride of Chucky Lion King ass hand. Then I tell you don't put her ass in a goddamn video. You know, listen. Stop putting her ass in a goddamn camera view. Talk about she pretty wet. Stop lying. Well, everybody try to tell you, CJ, what you doing wrong, you know, by putting Bride to Chucky in your videos. You said she ain't going away. You gonna keep putting her in the videos? Okay, the videos are gonna continue to goddamn decline. At this point, you gonna have to come up with a new goddamn channel because, baby, then he don't add goddamn Bride to Chucky Mama, the lady with the goddamn teacup. That's why his ass going crazy. Y'all, okay, we gonna go back. We gonna say this shit again because I already said this. Y'all remember that movie? Get out. Remember the lady with the damn teacup? Okay, CJ, right now your ass needs to get out. CJ. <laughs> CJ talking about if you looking for a job, put it in the comments. D-Lo will be going, what's up, D-Lo? Hey, D-Lo, how you doing, D-Lo? Talk about D-Lo going to be going through the comments to see who need a job. Who in the hell want to work for you, CJ? Huh? What What exactly would it be their damn job? What would they be doing, CJ? What would be the goddamn job? What are you hiring for, CJ? Because, shit, you, you must be looking to replace the whole team because all of them got to go. Every, everybody got to go because they ain't doing your channel no goddamn justice. Allegedly. He talk about they came to his channel to see how he going to get his kids back. No, it ain't, CJ. Ain't nobody came to your channel to see how you getting your goddamn kids back. Again, if the kids ain't on the goddamn video, then we know you don't have the kids. Okay? Here goes CJ talking about we put in a request. Who the hell is we? Because it better not be you and Bride of Chucky. Bride of Chucky is not your goddamn wife. So she better not be in that goddamn courtroom 
or, or wherever the hell she at with that Lion King ass hair standing next to your ass talking about we want to see the goddamn kids. She is not your goddamn wife. She is O-N-S-W-B. One night stands with benefit. I really wish she would care her ass to work. I really wish she would go to work and, and find something to do with her goddamn life instead of sitting on your goddamn chair. That's why the maid had to come in there and clean that goddamn chair because she sit there with that damn bushy ass Lion King hair. I bet you it's a dent. If she get her big ass up, it's probably a dent right there in that goddamn chair. Because that's where she always sit. Sitting on a goddamn chair doing nothing. And then he's talking about, well, if I had a phone number or or, or address, you know her goddamn address, CJ. Stop goddamn playing. He's talking about, if I had a if I had a phone number, I could have sent her some money. No, CJ. All you had to do is take it to the goddamn courts. You could have taken it to the courthouse and put yourself on goddamn child support. They'll locate Rossi to make sure she get the goddamn money. So stop lying. Here he here he go allegedly using excuses for why he can't do what he know he should do as a father. CJ, you your ass is not being prevented. Do you know how many courthouses put men on damn child support for not taking they, taking care of their goddamn children? So what is you talking about? You not being prevented from doing nothing. Right here. You got too many people in your goddamn ear whispering and telling you what you should and you shouldn't goddamn do. Instead of you doing what is right. You got too many people enabling your goddamn actions. Somebody, somebody need to tell you, you're wrong. So CJ, you say you willing to do anything to get your goddamn kids back? Okay, let's start with removing Bride of Chucky. How about that? How about go pick, go tell her to get in the car and get her ass home. Let's start with that. And when you do that, let, make a video and let me know. All right, so he's showing y'all the kitchen clean, finally, because we know Bride of Chucky lazy ass ain't cleaning up nothing. But I, I don't know if he's trying to imply that he's moving. I hope he do move. I, I, I've been saying this shit several videos ago. I already told you, CJ, do the goddamn blueprint. We talking in cold. Blueprint, blueprint, blueprint. CJ, you've been saying that you almost at 9 million subscribers since you and damn uh, Royalty broke up. That's damn near almost a year now. CJ, your ass ain't getting a 9 <laughs> Let me stop. But here he go, going downstairs to show y'all the goddamn toys. We already know that, CJ. Didn't you say that shit in the video about what? A month ago that you have not seen the twins yet? We know you have not seen the twins yet. So why do you have to keep saying that shit? So he's saying that he's showing y'all that he's been changing and he been stopped bashing and stopped doing all. CJ, didn't you just upload a picture of you and Bride of Chucky? And you just uploaded that, that caption. So what you mean you stop bashing? You is bashing. You trying to be funny. You know goddamn pale ass bride of Chucky didn't come in and do nothing for your ass. We see her sitting on the goddamn couch and all your goddamn videos doing nothing. So what could she have come in and did for you other than take your ass to the bed? Other than that, what substance does she have? Does she have any goddamn sense? Because we already see her ass slow, allegedly. What else does she have? What does she have to offer? Huh? Because right now she living off you. What does she have? Here he go talk about this home invasion again. Child, at this shit, we gonna hear about this home invasion two years from now. CJ, we get it. We understand. Okay. We get it. You keep reminding us as if we forgot. You just made a, you just made a video putting a bunch of racing thoughts together. Everything that you said in all, in this entire damn video, you already said it before. And you keep saying the same shit. You just wanted to put out a goddamn video. You got a whole goddamn team and y'all couldn't figure out a damn video to put out for the day. You just said, let me pick up this video and say a bunch of nothing. <laughs> Here goes CJ sounding like he a game show host in the goddamn shoe room. CJ, what is you talking about? You think because you give them um, materialistic things and money, that means you being the best parent knows the hell you no that's that's not that's not what a parent is okay all right now cj what goddamn camera you using with a goddamn filter because we know damn well your skin is not that goddamn smooth what, let me know put it in my comments yes cj yes cj we all know that you have done a lot of things for the homeless we have saw countless videos of you giving we get it, CJ. We get it. I'm going to be honest with you. I just think when you start 
bashing for royalty allegedly and you brought all these new people in the in the in the in the, in the camera view it was just a turn off to your audience cj stop saying people trying to tell you down because i know damn well I know when I be doing reactions to your goddamn videos, I do my shit in a comical way so it could be entertaining. It's all about entertaining the subscribers, okay? So they ass don't fall asleep. I'm going to say this, CJ. You know, at the end of the day, you a grown man. You could do what the hell you want to with your life. You in control. But when it comes to this whole YouTube thing, you got to stick with what people subscribe to your channel for in the beginning. And see... Now, I get it. Rosie is not there. The kids are not there. But the kids still could have been there if you did not do and say the things that you said. Once you take accountability for your actions, things will all fall into place. But until then, things are going to continue to go the way that it's going. You know, God here, again, I'm going to say this shit again. God here, all the talks behind clo closed doors, all the bashing, all the putting down, all the stuff that you said behind closed doors and all the stuff that you said on camera. At the end of the day, you're wrong. And I'm saying this shit again. You're wrong, CJ. Somebody need to tell you your ass is wrong. If those people are around you telling you you're not doing nothing wrong, then they not your goddamn friends. D-Lo, the only one that seems like he has some goddamn sense. And I know... D-Lo and Rosie, they had a close relationship. But at the end of the day, of course, because you and Rosie is not together no more, he's going to side with you because you pay him. That's how he make his money. So, of course, he's going to side with you. When he uploaded that video talking about he missed the twins, no, it wasn't even a video. I think he added something to his Insta stories. When he said that he missed the twins, that was true. He missed the family. That was true. He missed that situation. He missed that CJ, Royce, and the kids. All five kids. He missed that. He missed it. But what you got to understand is, well, let's say this. I say that to say this. You have to stick to what the people subscribe to your channel for. They didn't subscribe to your channel to see Arnold goddamn Schwarzenegger. They didn't sign up or subscribe to your channel to see goddamn Bride of Chucky prancing around with that and that big ass Lion King here sitting around on the goddamn chair doing nothing all goddamn day. All we see is leechers. They all leeching. That's what they doing. Leeching. And the man who did the damn podcast with your ass tried to tell your ass something, but you don't goddamn pay attention. You don't goddamn listen. He said, you don't know who all your friends is when you're rich. They be around. They all in your goddamn face as long as you have money. But you, that shit went in one ear and out the goddamn other. You was like, no, no, no. When you don't have nothing. No, he was trying to tell you right. You wasn't goddamn lit. Okay, guys. So I am done with my reaction with this video. Again, at the end of the day, CJ can make whatever decisions he want with, her, with his life and the content that he puts out. All I say, CJ, is take a look at your old videos look at the stuff that you've been uploading the stuff that you've been saying and then hopefully from there you'll understand where people is coming from but anywho guys if you would like to hear see more videos from your favorite girl don't forget to like comment share and subscribe until the next video bye guys